Jeremiah 30, 12 through 22. For thus says the Lord, your hurt is incurable and your wound is grievous. There is none to uphold your cause, no medicine for your wound, no healing for you. All your lovers have forgotten you, they care nothing for you. For I have dealt you the blow of an enemy, the punishment of a merciless foe, because your guilt is great, because your sins are flagrant. Who do you cry out over, to, over your hurt? Your pain is incurable because your guilt is great, because your sins are flagrant. I have done these things to you. Therefore, all who devour you shall be devoured, and all your foes, every one of them, shall go into captivity. Those who plunder you shall be plundered, and all who prey on you I will make a prey. For I, restore, I will restore health to you, and your wounds I will heal, declares the Lord, because they have called you an outcast. It is Zion for whom no one cares. Thus says the Lord, Behold, I will restore the fortunes of the tents of Jacob, and have compassion on his dwellings. The city shall be rebuilt on its mound, and the palace shall stand where it used to be. Out of them shall come songs of thanksgiving and the voices of those who celebrate. I will multiply them, and they shall not be few. I will make them honored, and they shall not be small. Their children shall be as they were of old, and their congregation shall be established before me, and I will punish all who oppress them. Their prince shall be one of themselves, their ruler shall come out from their midst. I will make him draw near, and he shall approach me. For who would dare of himself to approach me, declares the Lord. And you shall be my people, and I will be your God. What kind of Christians are we? By Jeremiah Burroughs. You do not need me to write to you about brotherly love, says the Apostle Paul. For you yourselves are taught of God to love one another. 1 Thessalonians 4.9 Lord, that one text is enough by itself to pierce our hearts through and through. Lord, are we the same kind of Christians today as they were then? I pray that it would be that way with us that we would not need to be written to or preached to concerning this. Is it obvious by the way we treat each other that you yourself have taught us to love one another? Amen. Amen.